Y'all, these people are too late doing this. The next story is about ba-da-ba-ba-ba, McDonald's, y'all. I love it. <laughs> Guess what? I only try to eat the fries these days. You know what? Sometimes I get a hankering for McDonald's and I go and I'm just like, just let me get a McDonald's and some fries. You know what I'm saying? And you take the fries and you put it on that McDouble and then you smash it down and then you go to eat it and it tastes so freaking good. But you know what's bad for you? And then when it hits your gut, your intestine, you're like, oh, here it is. It's moving its way through. You can feel it moving through like a snake. <laughs> but anyway... McDonald's is closing its doors in Russia, ending an era of optimism and increasing the country's isolation over its war with Ukraine. The Chicago uh, burger giant confirmed Monday that it is selling its 850 restaurants in Russia. McDonald's said it was seek a buyer who will employ its 62,000 workers in Russia. What does that mean? Does that mean they actually not they selling them to a franchisee who's actually going to keep the stores named as McDonald's? That's what it looks like to me. Right? Let me read that again. It's selling its 850 restaurants, 850 restaurants in Russia. McDonald's said it will seek a buyer who will employ its 62,000 workers in Russia. I mean, who is that going to be? You know? Who knows? Who knows? I know, I know they closed the doors in Russia. That part I do know. Ba-da-ba-ba-ba. Sorry, Russia. Y'all, this is too much going on. Let me move on to the next story. 